This is me <laughs> from school days. This was during the time of, of my first encounter. My childhood was strange to a certain extent. I was seeing things and my parents didn't. Nobody in my family seemed to see what I was seeing. My first encounter was when I was eight years old. I was playing at the base of a tree and I hear this voice say, David, behind you. And I turned around and there is this little hairy guy with large glowing eyes coming straight toward me. I thought it was the boogeyman. I didn't know what to think of it. What was interesting is that for a split second, I felt as if I was in his eyes looking at me. Then I just freaked and I ran to the barn and I glanced back and the little hairy guy was turning around and going back into the woods. The eyes were just glowing is the best way to put it. They just glowed. Uh, the next encounter, I went out to the barn to get a, I think it was a baseball or something little like that. And I hear a noise on the other side of the barn and I go take a look. And there is this giant insect-like being. It resembled like a praying mantis. And I just like look at it and I started screaming. As I did, he sprayed me with some type of bluish gray liquid. I ran away from the barn and I noticed that this grayish liquid was evaporating very quickly. I was very terrified. I mean, it's like, what in the world am I looking at? And for an eight-year-old, I mean, you don't know what to think. There was one time I was going over to a friend's house, and I'm walking uh, behind the barn and going through a field, and I get the impression I am being watched, but I didn't see anyone. And then I hear a sound, like the, the mooing of a cow, and I see a head coming up from behind a bush. And I'm looking at it and I'm saying, is that a head? Are those eyes? I start getting scared. And then suddenly I said to myself, why is it so bright? And I just fainted or just fell down and cr like curled up into a ball. And there were several little grays standing around me. But the next thing I know is that I hear three beeps and I am standing chest deep in these weeds. And I don't know how I got there. I was in the back field. I was looking for arrowheads. I happened to glance up and I see about eight or nine little blue guys drop from the sky and they hit the ground running straight toward me. I took off toward the house. I went around in front of the house. I looked underneath our house because it was on pillars. And I could see their legs on the other side. And then they just turned and walked away. That night, I'm looking out the window and who should I see but several of the little guys. Then I see them come in into my room and they take me outside. And we floated up to some type of craft. I am inside a room, a well-lit room, with one of the little grays, and a woman comes in. She has a long rod in her hand. She tilts my head back. A little gray guy holds me, and she thrusts the uh, rod up my nose. She inserted something inside my nose. And after she pulled it out, I said, you hurt me, you hurt me. And she says, let me see. And she looked at me and she made the pain go away. You know how we tag whales and stuff like that? 